This week's tutorial is on this beautiful copper smoky eye inspired by the summer. This smoky eye is soft enough to be worn during the day, but sexy enough to be worn at night. If you want to see how I accomplish this look, please stay tuned. I'm starting this look by filling in my eyebrows with a dark brown powder and an angle brush. I'm using a concealer to help create a more definite shape to my eyebrows. Now that my brows are shaped, I'm using a clear brow gel to keep everything in place. I'm starting my smoky eye by using a black cream shadow. I'm starting to blend out the black cream eyeshadow by using my fingers, but then I switched over to a larger blending brush to help disperse the color a little bit better. After applying my black cream eyeshadow, I'm going in with a short shader brush and I'm packing on a copper powder eyeshadow to help create that smoky copper look. After the copper eyeshadow has been applied to my eyelids, I'm going to use a flat blending brush to help blend that color up into the crease. After blending that copper eyeshadow into the crease of my eye, I'm going to go in with the same blending brush and a little bit of a warm brown color, and I'm going to blend that copper shadow out a little bit more into the crease to add more depth. Now I'm using a clean, round, fluffy eyeshadow brush to blend that softer brown. Now that my eyeshadow has been applied, I'm going to go in with a liquid eyeliner and create a nice, thin wing. Now I'm just applying a mascara to help prepare my eyelashes for the false lash application. After applying my false lashes, I'm going to go in with that same cream black eyeshadow from earlier and apply just a little bit underneath my eyes. Next, I'm just going to go in with the same copper eyeshadow and blend out that black cream shadow to create a smoky under eye effect. After applying my foundation off camera, I decided to add a little bit more spice to the look by putting a very shimmery gold eyeshadow on the inner corner of my eyes. Now that I'm completely finished with my eyes, I'm going to go in and shape my face using a very warm bronzer. I'm also going to go ahead and add a very light and natural blush. I'm going to finish off the look by adding a deep bright pink lipstick to my lips as well as a liner to match. And here you have it, the completed look. Thank you all so much for watching. You can check back with us next Monday for another tutorial. But if you can't wait that long, you can always check out my YouTube channel, Face the Throne, for more makeup tutorials.